Hi there. In this video, we are going to talk about cramping on the tennis court and how you can prevent it from happening. First, let's define cramping. When muscle contracts and tightens up involuntarily, it's called a cramp. Cramps can happen in your muscles, in the body, in the muscles in the body, but they are they are most common in the legs, feet and hands. Now, before we talk about how to prevent cramping on the tennis court, let's talk about the causes of cramping. The first causes of uh, cramping is fatigue. Uh, when the muscles are tired, they can become stiff and difficult to control, which can lead to cramping. Playing tennis for a long period of time without taking breaks or playing at a high intensity without properly warming up can cause fatigue and increase the risk of cramping. And another cause of cramping is uh, dehydration. Dehydration occurs when the body does not have enough fluids. It can lead to cramping in the muscles. Playing tennis in hot or humid conditions are not or not or not drinking enough water before or during the and after playing tennis can increase the risk of dehydration and cramping. Overuse of muscles. Uh, that's the last thing that can cause cramping. Overuse of muscles such as as by using incorrect technique or playing without taking regular breaks can lead to cramping. Incorrect technique can put unnecessary strain on the muscles. While playing for long periods of time without taking a break, breaks can cause the muscle to become fatigued and more susceptible to cramping. It is also important to learn and use the correct technique and to take regular breaks to prevent overuse of the muscles. So, how can you prevent cramping on the tennis court? Here are five tips. Uh, warming up properly before playing tennis. Warming up before playing tennis can prevent cramping by increasing blood flow or to the muscles and improving flexibility. A typical warming up uh, routine might include some gentle stretching, jogging or jumping jacks and some light hitting against a uh, or against an uh, against a practice wall or blackboard. The next, the next thing uh, you can learn to stay hydrated. Hydration is a common cause of cramping. So it's important to stay hydrated by drinking plenty of water plenty of water before or during and after playing tennis. It's so also a good idea to avoid alcohol and caffeine which can hydrate the board. The use of correct techniques when hitting the ball. Incorrect technique can be in a, in unnecessary strain on the muscles, increasing the risk of cramping. It's important to learn the use uh, uh, and use the correct technique when hitting the ball and seek guidance when a coach or instructor if you are unsure. Take regular breaks to rest and stretch. Playing tennis for a long period of time without taking breaks can lead to fatigue, which can increase the risk of cramping. It's important to take regular breaks to, to rest and stretch and, and to listen to your body if you're feeling tired or sore. Eat a balanced diet. Eating a balanced diet that includes a variety of fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grain can help to prevent cramping by providing the body with the nutrients it leads to functioning properly. It also a, it's also a good idea to avoid foods that are high in salt, which can cause the body to retain, to retain fluid and contribute to cramping. Because salt increases the body dehydration.